Luigi, time to wake up. Wake up. Oh, I'm up. I'm up. Why am I still in the greenhouse? I don't know. It was all a dream. I guess so. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Luigi's Mansion 3. Uh, pretty much one of the more bigger highlights of Luigi's Mansion 3 is coming up as we're heading up to Paranormal Productions. <gasps> we're going to make a movie. Bo, 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 bo. Yeah. And just in time, too, because uh, Iki has returned to us. Mm. Welcome back, Iki. And, and Matt's Matt. stuck in the laundry room. Mario. Aww. Aww. <laughs> Let me guess, you were stuck trying to get your fridge heels out of the, uh, out of the, uh, dryer? Yeah. Mario. It's cold at night. I want something Mario. comfortable to sleep in. Fair enough. So, uh, with that said, I uh, hope you all brought in your, your cameras, your tripods, or whatever it is you want to capture your footage. As, yeah, we're in the movie set. And remember, no smoking and no flash photography. No flash photography, you say? What I say to that? Bull. Ugh, I'm blind. <laughs> I would love, I don't know, I would have loved if in the soundtrack one of the songs was titled Quiet on the Set. <laughs> <laughs> So, this is actually one of the very first um, uh, places that they've shown off once the game was fully revealed later on. And, like, I guess we're going to get a little more into it the further we go into this place. I feel this is probably the one place where Luigi's Mansion 3's, you know, lost potential really starts to kick into effect. Also, hello. Oh, Striker. Yeah, Look yeah. all these fun little next level games callbacks. Oh, that's right. Oh, by the way, go back into the other room really quickly. Wait, the uh, other room. Okay. Oh, I was hoping that the uh, guardrails over there on the left was... Oh, yeah, no, no, yeah, the like, <laughs> But yeah, we see Don't there see. we have Strikers Charged, which I agree with people, I wouldn't mind seeing it. And if you look all the way in the back there, you see a poster with Lil Mac and Doc Lewis on it. Yeah. Well, oh, way yeah. to jump right to the very end, but yes, here's Punch-Out. Even better is that... Oh, I think Lil if Mac you pull that, hmm? yeah, pull that off, and there's a treat inside. What is it? It's just a lot of money and... Oh, Yay! hey! Punch boxing it. glove. Money and a boxing glove. Yep. Which you can use to break stuff. And a generic picture of a bear in the woods. Yeah, I'll say, what is that on the right? That, that, that photo on the right just there. Uh, can I... I mean, this one? Oh, maybe yeah, I can it's look their up that. upcoming game. I think it's Blast Ball? Also, hi, I'm here. Hey, Matt. We yeah, got, I already introduced you, like, I, twice. We yeah, yeah. yeah. No, nobody introduced... Only Damn. Steve did. Hey, Steve. Matt, hi. Everybody else introduced Icky. It's okay. So, whoa. You see Kirby on one of those posters? Uh, no. Again, this is only, this is only, these are only highlighting uh, Next Level Games' own productions. And, like, I was actually gonna... I mean, I could have sworn I see a silhouette of Kirby. That's King Boo. By the way, the I have not... a rap. By the way, fun yeah. fact, I have not played this game. And I really like that aiming reticle with the, uh, with the boxing glove there. Uh, yeah. Whoa. Uh, wow. Hit that speaker. I'm just kind of glad that the boxing glove just ignores blocks of physics and just art, you know. Yeah. Oh, nice. Ooh, new gem. Just like that. But how do we get it? Oh, oh simple. We just, call, we just call upon our little goof friend. Ew. Help me. So, and, oh. I mean, in reality, Luigi would just, you know, pop over that desk, but he I, can't. I guess, we sh I guess we should ask, since I don't think they've been here for this bit yet. Uh, Icky, Matt, uh, your thoughts on Gooigi? As a person, why? <laughs> why is why is he an amoeba? He's not a person, though. He's just blue. He's an amoeba. Amoeba. Here's my question: Why? Why, why not? not? Because co-op. I mean, it works for co-op. Because co-op shenanigans. Where's he going? I mean, granted, like if you want a co-op option oh. badly, you could just use Mario uh. or Daisy. Some of the way he just face plants. But yeah. Uh, oh, and that's right. We kind of showed this off a little bit in Scare Scraper, but this is a mechanic introduced in this floor. Tell yeah. You. The whole TV portals. Oh. oh, I love this movie. I call it TV portal. I call it instant, oh. ah. instant transmission. Oh, I remember doing that as a kid. Just putting oh, my yeah, face up the TV and getting the static on my nose. Unless I'm mistaken, isn't this another callback to a horror film? Poltergeist. Guys. Poltergeist, I guess, yeah. Yes. Oh, okay, so, they, so they just called, it, called upon it again. Oh, yeah. Oh, I guess it was. Poltergeist, one of the few PG horror movies, because it literally did not have anything that is too scary for R-rated, but it was horrifying, trust me. And also the fact that yeah. there is a Poltergeist remake that came out a few years back. Don't watch it. It's terrible. My mom, my mom, my mom, he, my mom said... He just said my, 
Go ahead. He just said L-Man. Yeah. Oh. I think... Danny oh, no. L-Man? Hmm. I wonder if Danny L-Man... And actually, I did want to mention it earlier, but yeah, basically, again, this all calls back to all of next level games. We got Strikers, we got Dark Moon, we got... Actually, this is... Actually, I believe this is supposed to be a scrap, the uh, scrapped Mario Spikers game that um, they were going to try making for the Wii. Oh. Which looked really funny. As I said, I thought it was supposed to be Blast Ball, but... And, oh, well. and this right here, I believe, is supposed to be a reference uh, Federation Force. Is it? Huh. Is it? I mean, that's the only other game that I can think of that Next Level Games has under their belt. Yeah. That, well, who wants to be, like, reminded of that? My guess is that maybe <laughs> it's a game nice. that is coming oh. next by them. I mean, not I'll be fair to Federation Force. It's really not that bad of a game. Like, it's actually a really good co-op game. It was just really poorly timed. Yeah, that's the thing. It's like, it's a good game that came out at a really bad time. There we go. We're in. in a way, yeah, it's, it's kind of like, hey. like Mega Man's inclusion in um, Street Fighter vs. Tekken. Or and, Nuts and, and Bolts. Right, and right, the thing Ooh. I was going to mention originally was that, yeah, what my mom mentioned that with Poltergeist, it was funny how Stephen oh. King, or not Stephen yeah. And how Stephen Spielberg, oh. The Spielberg tragedy! Oh, 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 is this my... Is this what I, Morty, director of the finest films, and Destin for? How could I lose it? And so you might want to look into that vocal tick of yours. I am a beauty! Worthless movie director! That's all! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Even the sparkle from this beautiful button is now nothing but a doll. You! Can I borrow that real quick? Oh, if you don't want it, I could have it. Uh, I mean, I could take it off your hands. I could spit it up a bit. <laughs> oh! Ah! My bright red megaphone! Where are thou? Boo. Boo. I could give anything to be able to hold my dear, sweet megaphone again. Well, you know, this is a very simple solution. I just have to flash him and then suck him up. Uh, sir? Sir? But he's I never gonna look at you. He's, he's never gonna, gonna look at you to be able to flash him, though. Oh, wow. I am the sir. only man in this room. I like There's that totally nobody next to me. Oh, oh, sad. I have no eyeballs. So, I'm just gonna get this right down to the point. This guy right here is Morty, and he is probably the best ghost in this entire game. Mainly Unfortunately, he's the only... Go ahead. He is the only good ghost. Well, not the only good ghost, but... He's more indifferent from, than, like, straight up... He's the only one besides Helen Gravely that actually speaks. And, oh, and besides the bellhop. I kind of get the feeling that he's more concerned with himself over taking care of Luigi. And, I mean, that's yeah. th that's pretty much goes to my- Oh! Get, get off me! Get off me! Get off me! Get off me! Oh. That actually oh, scared the shit for the first time. Uh -huh. Fuck really? Oh, oh, God. God. Oh, God. oh, how could you? you crazy oh! Little oh. How could you? Thanks! Money, money, oh. money, money. There was a donut in that. You gotta love Ultra See, it's alright because he paid us. With exposure. <laughs> and a toy car. Thanks for the money. No, get, get the pearl! Get the pearl! Get the pearl! My Aunt Pearl! Doop. I got it. Don't worry. You got it. Anyways, I was going to try to make my earlier statement regarding Morty. Yes, he is the only ghost in the game that's actually a really... Well, he's generally a nice ghost, and, well, he just has his own agenda. He has absolutely no care in the world for what Luigi's Happy doing, and even then... And not only that, it's like... If, if I mean, depending on your actions, you don't even have to really worry about sucking him up. He's like the only ghost you can actually... Ignore. He's got his own aspirations. I'm sorry, I was just highly amused by that toy car just driving around the entire room. But that car's having fun. Oh, and I can yeah. say keep, it, keep an eye on that bucket for later. But, so how are we going to help him, James? Well, see, see all these uh, TV sets? Yeah. They allude to uh, certain rooms that are all across this floor, and we're going to need to um, make the most of these the TVs and these sets in order to solve the puzzle to get his red, bright red megaphone back. Uh -oh. Alright, so let's see what's in set number one. Money. Well, that's, money. that's a good start. Money. Sorry for money. Money. Yeah. Good start to a nice movie set. Just, yeah, no, I, I feel like if there's one thing that this game sorely lacks is, well, it needed more ghosts like Morty because he's interesting. Like, honestly, the most interesting out of the lot. Yeah. They need to be more talkative. Instead of just saying, hey, I'm an evil ghost who lives in Bayou because why not? I'm, I'm just evil. Well, I mean, I'm... Hey, I'm... Ah. I'm the bartender ghost. I serve the bar and attack you as a ghost. Ha ha ha. Oh, no. So basically like the ghost in Luigi's Mansion 1. Oh no, wait, I'm not allowed to say that. Honestly, no. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, honestly, no. I was, honestly, no. I was going to say The Shining. 
Whee. Well, to be fair, I, a lot of those ghosts in Luigi's Mansion <laughs> One, well, it, they didn't even really care about you. You were the one that were that was that was pulling, putting up a fight. I see a dog. Dude. Right. So you're saying so Luigi is the true villain in Luigi's Mansion One? Yeah. In a way, you could totally see it like that. Well, because it was the whole because we were the ones invading their home. I mean, him and his stupid brother just invaded this, you know, this derelict mansion. It was just. Could have been somebody else's house. Because that's the other thing. It seems like yeah. both you and King Boo were both intruders on what was supposed to be that ghost's yeah. house. Yeah, basically. It was just King Boo being an asshole and finding, hmm, this seems like a house I can use for my own benefit. <laughs> yeah! But King Boo was locked in the cellar. Do, do, do. Do, do. Oh no, the duck ran away. Ducky. I love the sound Ducky. that the duck made when it fell. It's like, Grr. Hmm, eh. It's down there, but we can't reach it. So I guess we better get to work and figure out what kind of movie set we're on. Well, let's yeah, see. If only we allergic to water. Oh, it's The Shining. Not The Shining. This. Or not The Shining. Sorry, sorry. sorry. The, the, no, the, the ring. The ring. The ring. Yeah, with the whale. Yeah, which 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 is a, which was sorry. originally a Japanese horror film. No, it's the Chupacabra. Um, what's happening? Yeah, yeah, no. Yeah. No. The Japanese film is known as. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Hi. oh, also, um, note that she's holding. Nice statue, huh? Mind if I take it? <laughs> Thank you. Note that she has her arms held out, almost as if she's supposed to be holding something. Okay. And as you see there, and as you see there, the way this puzzle works is that these film sets will not be active unless somebody's behind that camera. And as you see, I cannot. There we go. Okay, we exited the room now. Yeah. You did. Yeah, my my. You basically uh, created a yeah, film set. There's a problem with uh, Steve and I. Our streams love to go. Nope. <laughs> well, we're fixing it. Come on, come on. Well, well I'll, I'll say, like, mine kind of, like, no. wisened up, and now it's working fine now. Oh, so because but of you, it doesn't work good right. right for me. Aw. Let's see what's on set two. Alrighty. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, uh, no, it's Lord of the Rings. It does kind of look like Lord of the Rings. Things. Or in this case, Lord of the Things. Actually, I'm thinking more Princess Bride. Well, uh, either way, medieval. You know, my name is Luigi you... Mario. You kidnapped my brother. Prepare to die. <laughs> <laughs> Prepare to game over. You know, you keep on using that word. I don't think it means what you think it means. Hmm. That's conceivable! I am the Dread Pirate Mario. <laughs> Inconceivable! <laughs> Oh no no! It this this is one hundred percent actually Game of Thrones. It's the Mushroom oh. Wars again. Oh god! Wait, it took place that long ago. I am a man. I've been in business a long time, Mario. It's like I've lived longer than you could ever imagine, Mario. As I'm I've seen things that no man alive or dead should ever have the displeasure to see. There's a wilting sprout here. Keep that in mind for later. By the way, I know you're being Wario right now, Steve, but honest to God, it sounded like you were Aku for a second. I have seen things I, no one did, else has. I, Wario, the shape-shifting plumber of darkness. <laughs> I am just an unspeakable wafting. But a foolish red plumber wielding a foolish green plumber wielding a shape shifting. I'll say, I'll say, stop you. I'll say, stop you there. Stop you there. That's the plot of Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. Uh, no, the best part Sorry. is it sounded like you said, but a foolish red plumber wielding a foolish green plumber. That's why I said. That's exactly what he said, and that, that's exactly what he said. I said that's the plot of the brothers. That actually is accurate. Oh goodness. Okay, okay I know we're going, we're kind of going out of order, but let's see what's on scene number four. I oh, think. Right. Oh, gold spider. Gold spider. Huh. Yeah. Well, I'm trying to think. I think if this is the one I think it is, this is the uh, this is the one room out of the lot that confused me quite a bit. Same. Yeah. Uh, ah. Yeah, oh, I love what we just saw there. Is that j just like any Hollywood set should have the emergency money? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was just funny to watch. I've never seen that oh, actually. Me neither. I have never. <laughs> by the way, yes, emergency money should totally be a thing in any Hollywood. Just in case, case it just say, it just well, says no, break. It just says break if not rich. Oh, oh this, this, this room. Oh yeah, this oh, is the room. I, I, I oh, this is my least yeah. favorite of the four rooms. Honey, I shrunk the Luigi. But hey, look, yep. it's the megaphone. Gotta see the megaphone. 
Looks like it's trapped in some spider webs. Those must be hardy webs. I don't think you could suck them out. Or they could be a prop. And look at the size of these gold coins. I'm rich. Small enough to fit in my in my vacuum. Oh. Huh. I did not know you could do that. <laughs> Break them down to size. <laughs> you see, fun fact. I learned that in this world, because I am a magical creature myself, I can, for some reason, make giant spiders. Don't ask. Me. Don't. The money broke apart into smaller money. <laughs> oh, yeah. that, that's how this works. That sort of makes sense because that's how stuff works. It's called subsidizing your ween. I forget, how do you get that gem? Luigi, that's still my money. Oh, that one's actually pretty simple. Just call Huang Luigi. Huh? Oh, that's right, because it's technically a pipe. I mean, it looks like a pipe. Hooray. He hold. That's easy. He home, boys. All right, hold on. Are the gems, like, supposed to be, like, themed to whatever place you're in? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah, they're filming them. Instead of just being, like, the same assortment of shapes and different color. Guess who has not played this game? Now, for those wondering what's up with all these big, big-ass props, it's because we're gonna, we're gonna do our own parody of Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. Oh, it's a creature feature. Honey, I Shrunk the Plumbers. Where's the creature, though? I see a feature, but no creature. Behold. <gasps> Oh, it's just a little prop. Giant big spider. <laughs> oh, and it has its golden spider babies. A shit ton of them. Holy crap. Hey, that was so much it lagged a little. <laughs> but yeah, okay, so so the creature feet so the so that spider is just some sort of red herring. We need to figure out how to get this cobweb because it's stuck. Mm. Yeah, like we have to go we can't, we can't get Luigi in here either, because he's technically uh, the one who's the camera. Money's going to disappear soon. I'm mm. just throw a coin at it. Toss a coin to the cobweb? No, that's not what you have to I, do. But basically, like, he just... on his own key. Like, hmm. I know I brought it back a few times, but it really is the answer. Remember how they get rid of webs in Dark Moon? Right. Oh. Like, this is, like, yeah. this is all a very elaborate puzzle, and I'm... And it's gonna take you using everything from uh, every set in order to actually see your deep through. And that's why those TVs right. are there, too, as a fast what? travel. We haven't played Dark Moon. Yeah. Oh. Did you say but we also, played Dark Moon? The first money. You haven't, Nikki? Money is most important. No, right I said, but what of those that haven't played Dark Moon? Oh, well then, you're kind of screwed. Uh, li literally, I can explain it. <clears throat> Fire to destroy all you got. Kill you use that song a lot. Do you know any other songs? No. That's okay. The, the other one he knows is the really loud one. I'd rather him not use the loud one. Burn the ground! Burn the ground! Yeah. But, yep. Is that even a song, though? I mean, and that was and that was actually something you missed earlier, Ricky. That was something we talked about. Is that like, with with how this game starts off and everything. Like for those who haven't played Dark Moon, this game, in terms of its tutorial or lack thereof, like it, this game expects you to already be familiar with quite a lot from the 3DS title before, like, or just it allows it, it, it expects you to have accepted a lot of it, like Pulcher Pup or uh, the Dark. I'm sorry, player. I thought you hated hand holding tutorials. Fair. Yeah. I thought you didn't like extensive. It's not like this game outright demands you to actually have played Dark Moon beforehand. Like they do still give you like the heads up on how these mechanics will still work. Yeah, that's I mean, fair. hell, that's pretty much what Pulcher Pups are here for. I don't know, also, why, but the sound of ha. Ryan kind of makes me laugh because it sounds so like teeny weeny. Oh, depth oh. perception, don't fail us now. Oh <laughs> yeah, this this is easy to trip up. Okay, that's okay. Enough. That works. Not as easy as that. Bye bye. Oh. It's a good thing ball damage doesn't exist. That is a shattered tailbone. Who here has ever been to Universal Studios? Me. I have. Oh. I never have. I have once. I went to the one in California. Hold on. Uh, hey, what's in that basket over there? Really quick, the Universal Studio? <clears throat> the one in Florida is better. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that, that's the only one I went to. I've been to the one in Florida. Except the one in California is the one that's getting the Mario one. Yeah. I thought the one in Japan was getting the Mario one. And also... Well, We'll get it later. Continue, Gui. But also, uh, I, I went at a time before they took out the Back to the Future ride and replaced mm -hmm. it with The Simpsons. I've been on the Back to the Future ride. It was a lot of fun. However, they took out my personal favorite ride years ago, and that was the King Kong one. Oh, uh, what they replace it with? Oh, well, that was because of fi well, well, that was because of fire. The fire, yeah, a fire I, torched and destroyed I, a lot of the set. I was on that run. I, I was on that too. I I, I saw that. Do they still have the Marvel section. I know there's a Marvel section at Disneyland, but no. But like, do they still have the one at Universal? Uh, yeah, they do. They have a couple of things. Oh it's, god! It's, oh my god! It's, 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 Coins. 
Wah! Oh. Uh, Nacho! Wah! Hey, who's that funny little fellow in the basket? I don't know. What? I'm also. I'm Good more question. looking. Who is oh. that funny little baby in the basket? It's a ghost! Oh! A gem ghost. Oh, what an adorable little babu. Let me bash its head in. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh. Come on. Don't be stubborn. Yep. There you go. Let you me go. have your carcass. But yeah, no, I'm trying to figure out why the heck were there all of these dang fire extinguishers everywhere? What kind of movie is this, James? You're probably not going to like it, Logan, because it's a fire thriller. It's Volcano. Oh, it's a disaster flick. No. Not, not, one, not a disaster film. I hate those. No. Not volcano. <laughs> but we we Whoa. have to reinforce the fact that our greatest enemy is man. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> the fire <Yeah>. truck. <laughs> wow. So let's see if they're going to be the ones to put out the fire. I guess so. There he goes. <laughs> but it's actually a fight. They're going to try to put us out instead, I think. They actually do try and put out the fire. Like, they totally ignore you. Well, because they are, they are the movies. I mean, the oh, ghost. Wait. Uh oh. Never mind. Yes. I mean, the ghost film projector. There's I mean, no the escaping ghost... this set. We gotta deal with them. Yeah, but yeah, no, the ghost film. Which can be studio. kind of annoying, assuming you don't have. Which can be annoying if you're doing if you're doing doing this without doing the puzzle first. Oh, I guess so. Yeah. yeah. Is there a, wait? There is a puzzle to this place. Yes. Yes. Oh. You have to do things in a certain order. Oh, I did. Yeah. What? I thought we were only water, like you know, vulnerable. Well, fire gets you too. Water insoluble. We're weak to the elements, like I said. Is there something we need to do in order to solve the puzzle? No, but the fire does... I think you do need to have the fire to solve a puzzle in one of the other rooms. Yes. Oh, boy, that's right. That's why we need that open. Gotcha. Yeah, you have to tackle these sets in a certain order. Oh, the backup. Wait, here comes the cavalry. Wait a minute. I'm not a vehicle. I'm an angry man. <laughs> you murdered my friends. I love. I don't know why he keep that copy of like. I like that he he self acknowledges. That's right. I'm an angry man. <laughs> I can punch people. I am the angriest. Ooh, the pizza's here. I'm a big yeah. funny blockhead. Gee, I wonder where the ghost is, guys. <laughs> you you meet you you save pizza and now now I immediately want pizza. Yeah, no, it's damn been a while since I've had pizza. Damn it, I want pizza <laughs> too. You know what? That 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 settles it. Like, I know we I know we talk about it a lot how we all should meet up one day. We should all chip in right. and order like a bunch of pizzas. Yes. We should go to Pizza Hut so I could get their stuffed crust. Yeah, pizza or sushi. We all need to hang out in person, order pizza, and just play Jackbox. All right. Uh, that would be I really nice. Pizza. I really we had pizza. There's so. fire on this set. Ooh. Commencing launch. Not yet. Crap. We should set Luigi on. No. Okay, so this is all starting to come together, and this also confused me a lot because the first step of all these puzzles is we actually have to grab something from the center room. 